Hey guys, this is Gabe Gibbets with Blue Guru Digital Marketing, making digital and data work for you. Today we're talking about local SEO. This is part two of a four-part series. So if you've missed the first one, go back and watch that one. It talks about just the basics of local SEO, okay? And then we are talking today about Google My Business, what it is, and how why it's so important, okay? So the first thing is Google, like we mentioned in the last video, takes about 90% of the pie when you're talking about searching for things online. So anything that Google says or does is going to be the most important thing to really listen to because they're leading the charge on everything search for the internet. Okay. So Google My Business is Google's way of allowing businesses with brick and mortar locations, like I mentioned in the last video, and um, with the service area to, to take those and to register online and say, hey, I am a real business and I, I want to be found online. Okay, so what you go, you go to google.com slash business and you have to sign in with your Google, with your Gmail account. And once you do that, you can register, you can fill out your name and your address and then you get, um, you can either tech, have them text you or you can have them send you something in the mail. I think there are two different options. And so that confirms that you are a business. Now there are ways to optimize it. So we'll talk about just a few ways to optimize it right now. Um, if you are, so you need to read all of the all of the information on how to name your business. So if you are um, a doctor, you do you name some you name it differently than if you're um, a, a business. Or if you are a one person business, you can do your business name colon then your actual name um, if you want to do that. So that allows people to find you in two different ways. Now you can't keyword stuff for a location. You can't say like, for me, I can't say Blue Guru Digital Marketing, Lexington, Kentucky. I can't do that. You, that, you will get dinged for that at some point. Even if you see other people doing it, don't do it because you need to follow all the rules that Google has and they, they, they put them in place for a reason, okay? So, um, and then you can put your location, you can select, like if you work out of your home, you can select whether or not um, you want your location to be seen, and then that location, that address needs to be everywhere, everywhere, so we'll talk about directories in the next video, that you have to have the same business name, spelled and typed out the same way and the same address everywhere on online okay so if you are on facebook or if you are on um, yelp or if you are on um, hot frog or any of those places which we'll talk about in the next video they have to be the same it's called nap name address and phone all of them need to be the same okay so once you confirm that then we'll talk about directories in the next video. If you have any questions, ask them in the comments below and we will tackle them together. So let's let's head to the next video for general directories, what they are and why you need to be in them. We'll talk to you soon.